After all that b-roll you just saw <laughs> of our travel we have made it we are here in Vancouver let's get this trip started all right well before anything else happens I'm gonna need you guys to click that subscribe button click that like button and click that bell icon so you're notified whenever any of these awesome Alaska videos come out but here we are we are in Vancouver we are in our hotel room which, what do you think of this, Crystal? This is awesome. This view is so cool. Yeah, we are staying at the Pan Pacific Hotel. Sorry, I don't know how to put my arm here. So I was just going to do this. We are staying here at the Pan Pacific Hotel, <laughs> which is right here at the port, at the terminal for tomorrow. It's awesome. Yeah. It's a beautiful hotel, beautiful view. But enough talking about it. Let's give you a look at what this view is. There it is. There is our view. This is a premier harbor view room, I think is what it was called. But we got the celebrity. I don't know the name of it, but it's the one that the tugboats wouldn't move from. So they got stuck for like two days. There's the Royal Caribbean ship. I believe that's a Holland America ship. Yes, it is. I mean, we got all three ships we can see right here. So tomorrow morning I am waking up and I'm watching the Disney Wonder pull in. I mean, right over there, you got Vancouver off to the side there. I mean, it's like the first day it's rained apparently in like three months, everybody keeps telling us. So we brought the rain with us, but it's awesome. This is just beautiful. Now let's give you a quick, quick rundown of what our room looks like. All right, so we are on the 20th floor here at Pan Pacific Vancouver and we have like this little entryway so anyway we're 2015 here's our room and it comes with a crystal she's the door lady as you walk in we've got the bathroom over here to the right do the mandatory vlogger wave in the mirror I mean, just a normal bathroom normal sink vanity mirror nice shower you know we got oh there's the toilet okay found the toilet room but yeah i mean Nothing crazy special about the bathroom, but it is nice. So very nice finishes in there. This is our mirrored closet. This reminds me of like my dad's house, like growing up, reminds me very much of that. We got a couple chairs right here. Nice little lamp. Crystal standing over there by a desk we have. It's actually a really big desk. I like that a lot. And we got a chest of drawers over there if you need it. Mini bar or drawers. And the bellhop actually was showing us in here, you have wine glasses, regular glasses to go cups, your coffee pods. Oh, they got a corkscrew. That's awesome. Anyway, that's that. So yeah, then the mini bar, mini bar, mini fridge, whatever you want to say. It's right there. Oh, there's creamers in there for the coffee. And then I already showed you the view out that window, but here is our view out of this window. We have these two huge windows. It's awesome. Love it. And then we got just the two double beds. I think they're queens. And then over there, I think we have, is that espresso? That is espresso. We have an espresso maker, water pitcher and an ice bucket and two bottles of water. That's cool. And then there's another chair. There's lots of seating and room in here. And I mean, we like, we had like just a regular room and they had like a price drop and I jumped on the internet and grabbed it and this room actually was cheaper than the original room we had. So it worked out great. That's what we got, we are starving. So we are gonna get some clothes out of our bags real quick and then we are gonna head and get something to eat and get some coffee. Oh, there she is. There is our hotel from the outside. We're staying way up there, but on the other side, the cruise ships all sit behind this building. 
This is like the port right here in the heart of downtown Vancouver. But Crystal and I, we're gonna go find the Tim Hortons, get some coffee, because we gotta have Tim Hortons, and maybe something to eat, like a snack. And Crystal wants to find uh, a couple bottles of wine so she can bring them on the ship and enjoy them. All right, let's go explore downtown. All right, so we ran back to the room to drop off the wine that Crystal got to carry on to the cruise. Real quickly, Tim Hortons, uh, the donuts, Tim Bits, they're good. They're a donut hole. Um, it's too late in the day, in my opinion. They didn't have any fresh ones, but they're good. They're, you know, they're tidying me over. It's a good snack before dinner. The cold brew I got, if you like Starbucks with that like burnt taste, this is not the coffee for you. This is more of like a, a rich coffee taste, I would say. Like, I enjoy Starbucks because I like that burnt dark roast flavor. So I would actually say I probably like their cold brew better than Tim Hortons, but Tim Hortons is still good and I'm gonna go over there in the morning and get one before everybody else is probably awake when I watch the Disney Wonder come in. So anyway, Tim Hortons. Crystal got some like pure sugar s'mores drink cause she's a sucker for anything s'mores, but it's like pure sugar and you can like see all whipped cream and graham cracker and marshmallow and chocolate. And anyway, she just said it's pure sugar. So that means it's awesome. So anyway, there's our view again. It's awesome. Just like Crystal's awesome sugary drink. So yeah, we're just gonna keep a counter of how many times I say awesome right here. Anyway, we're gonna head back out and uh, do some exploring. So on one side you have the convention center, on the other side you have the ship terminal. There's Crystal. So and then smack dab in the middle you have the Pan Pacific Hotel. So this hotel covers everything basically it looks like and then right there, there is the walkway to the ship terminal. So that's where we're going tomorrow. We literally just come to the ground floor and we're at the ship terminal. That's awesome. Right now we're gonna go over here to the little walkway that's by the convention center and check out all the ships. I can see the Holland America lifeboats through those windows. They're all getting ready to leave. We got some people out on their balconies. And then down there we have Royal Caribbean. And there is the hotel right there. And our room is like up there. I think one of those is our room right there. That's so cool. There we have the Serenade of the Seas Royal ship. I have to say, we just walked past the Holland America ship, the Nordam, I don't know how to say it, I'm sorry, but I was quite impressed actually with what the balconies looked like. They were really cool. And I, I kind of like the Royal ship. I've never seen any of these ships up close before, so it's really cool to see these ships right now. Oh, and I missed it. Holland America just blasted their horn. There they go. They are pulling out right now. They're having their sailing away party. Doesn't look like too much of a party. Those are Crystal's people. That is, I bet you they watch Murder, She Wrote, just like Crystal. So we were walking up and both our friend Heidi and I thought this was part of the hotel. Nope. It's the Celebrity Eclipse. It's not part of the hotel. It is totally the cruise ship. Like these, these ships are so big. Like I've only been on Disney ships, so I know no different. But it's kind of, it's not kind of cool. It's really cool to just like, here's the Celebrity Eclipse. Here's the Serenade of the Seas. And oh, down there, there is all an America ship. Barely, you can still see it. It's pulling out past the Royal Caribbean ship right down there. It's about to get fully out of here, out of port. <laughs> <That's> yeah. <awesome. laughs> yeah, and there's, that's the hotel. So cool. Well, it looks like celebrities smoking down there, so they're getting ready to get out of here. This is a, sorry guys, I keep saying it, but it's cool. We've never experienced this, so it's awesome to see. All right, that's, that's the last time I'm gonna bring it up, but there is the Holland America ship now. Completely away from port, heading out. That'll be us tomorrow at this time. Have fun guys, get it all warmed up for us. Get those waters ready. Now we're just over here by the convention center. Just kind of hanging out, walking around. We got the like little seaplane harbor over here. Got their gas station right there, which is pretty cool to see. I mean, I'm from Colorado guys, I'm landlocked. Like, that's pretty cool to see. We just watched a plane out there take off. Like he's like right there. And then that's like a big, we got like a big plane flying over. He's maybe landing, I'm not quite sure. No, that's the guy, that's the guy I just took off right there. 
There he is. Okay. Wow. I don't know, guys. I might have to stay here. This is like really, really cool. So we found this really cool rooftop area over here at the convention center. It's just wide open. Plenty of space for our friend's son to run around. But it's really nice. What I really like is Canada has all these like roofs with greenery and things on them. But right now, they haven't had rain, I guess, in like two months. We brought the rain, as I said earlier. So they're kind of brown. But it's cool that they have. Like, it's just nice to see. It's nice to see something different than what I see every day at home. They have us in what they call the barrel room, and if you look up here, looks like they have some whiskey barrels that they have turned into their lights. It's very cool, and you can look right out the window and watch the planes. Well, he was just sitting here, and I look up, and there's a moose over our table just staring at us. Anyway, we're just chilling here. We got some fried pickles, some chips and guac coming. We got some pizzas, some fish and chips. It's going to be a good dinner, because we are starving. That bad vlogger moment, we didn't get the food. Those were the fried pickles. They were obviously good. Chips and guac and salsa, also good. We had, this is like our first meal of the day, so we're just eating. So who knows what you're gonna see, but so far, so good. All right, some food has showed up. I got the hot calabrese pizza, which is salami, mozzarella, basil. Looks awesome. Crystal's got these big old fish and chips over here. Our friend's got a prosciutto and arugula pizza to share. Trace has got some chicken tenders that his dad's going to eat too. <laughs> Alright, we're going to go eat. We're starving. Okay, so we walked past a gelato place on the way back to the hotel. So I had to get some Oreo and mint chocolate chip gelato. Crystal got passion fruit because she's got to get passion fruit anything. What did Trace get? Strawberry. Strawberry. Chase is just grubbing on some strawberry. His mom somehow magically found room for some strawberry gelato. <laughs> but we're just, you know, having some ice cream, enjoying the night. Who knows where we go after this party. All right, we are back here at the Pan Pacific in our room. I uh, just got back from dinner and the gelato I showed you. Dinner, service, was not great. It was slow. It took like 20 minutes for them to finally get to our table and get our drinks, but they rebounded. Once he got to our table, he did a great job. The food was amazing. The food was delicious. The food saved the meal. It was so good. And now we, that was the only meal we really had today, but it was delicious. It wasn't just because we were hungry. <laughs> good food. So tap and barrel. I think they just, you know, staffing issues. We get it. The food though, amazing, uh, amazing. I'm using the TV right now for lighting. If you can't tell, because the lighting in this room is really bad. Anyway, we are going to jump in the shower. We're going to organize some luggage and everything, get those set. Because tomorrow, it's embarkation day. We are getting on the Disney Wonder. Hopefully today you enjoyed the little few hours we had here in Vancouver. Just exploring around the Pan Pacific. Watching those seaplanes. I just, I could have watched them all day. It was so cool. That's how you know I'm landlocked, is watching a seaplane is very exciting to me. Anyway, haven't done so already. Click that like button, click that subscribe button, click that bell icon so you're notified whenever we put out a new video. But most of all, thank you all so much for stopping by, and for the love of the mouse, never forget that it all started with a mouse. Hope you guys enjoyed my hat hair as well. We only need